Hello everyone, Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Tubbyland Return Revamp, where as promised, we will be taking on Night 2 in this video today as well. So, without further ado, we will take on Night 2 and see what it has to offer for us. Lala. Wow, you did a great job. Well, Thank you. I guess there's probably some difficulty in sitting in one place all night and looking through some cameras while doing literally nothing else. Anyways, I called again because I'm supposed to update you on new developments that concern you as the company puts it. Uh, actually, one of the other animatronics is now active. Okay. One, which I think is called Poe. Yes, it's Poe. Now, now I'm remembering. Also, the technicians found out an issue about the robots. Apparently they identify human faces as tubby toast. Okay, now I'm remembering Poe's act of this night, just like Lala on night one. Pick up any stray toast and put it back into the toaster? It's pretty unsanitary, but it saves those pennies. It's also really unhealthy if it's a human being crammed in that toaster. Oh, Anyways, God. that means you don't want them to get a hold of you. Nobody does. But they become more active as the night bugs work through the week. And where's Lala anyways? I'm losing track. They seem to reset as the night bugs leave, though. Which is really weird. It's just something to keep in mind. I There's think Lala. I'm getting something. Oh, yeah. Poe. Um, although she's functional, she can't really see due to a lack of eyes. It's been hell for the company to find her. There's Poe. Speak of the devil. He's also able to scan her surroundings, though, with other senses. Like smell and sound, however. That means making sudden movements might be Poe scanned your face. Oh, well. Lala's here. So, uh, and Poe just moved. Flipping the monitor and using the vent shutter will also make her be more aware, but to a lesser extent, actually. The monitor itself also makes a bit of noise while it's on, too. So when she appears, just don't move. Simple enough, right? Anyways, have fun with those two. Peace. Peace. Alright, so Poe's voice is actually different. It's actually... Wait, did Lala come? No, okay, no she didn't. I'm... Oh, I see Poe. I remember how to deal with her. You have to stay still until she leaves. Okay. As I was about to say, um, Poe's voice is actually... Um, in the original, it's creepy because she has a high-pitched voice, but in this game, she has a woman... Like a... Like a, a dementing woman voice, which is just as creepy as the old one. Okay. There's Lala. I'm only focusing on checking on the camera and Paul. So for this night, I'm just going to focus on checking the camera for Lala, like the vent camera meeting, and then I'm going to check the left side for Paul. Because Paul's important too, not to mention. Yes, I hear her footsteps, which her footsteps sound completely different. Like, they don't sound like... They don't sound like you're on skis. They sound like like someone's walking in boots. And she actually talks more softer than the original. Which is just as creepy as the original. I'm not going to lie. See, just like that. Okay, I'm listening for Paul. Oh god, that was a creepy hello to me. Poe, you are just, your voice, your voice is just as creepy as in the original name. Oh, and I just heard Lala come in the vent. Okay. I gotta check for Poe, because I'm, she, she's coming closer just like Lala was. There's Poe. Yes, I am here, Poe. Thank you for asking. God, your voice is funny in this game, but creepy at the same time. In fact, it's, it's actually less, it's less creepy in this game than the original. Because in the original, Poe sounds like this. Are you there? Hello! Like that. Whereas in this game, it sounds like this. Hello, are you there? 
<laughs> Poe, you are more funny in this game than in the original. Oh, Lala. Okay, got rid of Lala. I'm checking for Poe right now. Okay, Poe's coming closer and closer. Yeah, I, yeah, figure it out yourself, Poe, just like in the original. La la. Where did everyone go? Yeah, you're... <laughs> figure that out yourself, Poe. <laughs> Okay, I, I, just, I just had to deal with Lala at the van. Now I gotta check for Poe. I'll check for Lala real quick. Now Poe. Yep, got Lala at the vent. I'm listening for Poe. Lala left. Poe hasn't came yet. I'm listening, though. Okay, I feel like Poe's coming closer. I don't know if, she, if she's there yet. And I just checked the vent camera for Lala. Figure that out, Poe, and I just had to deal with Lala again. Are you there, Poe? Answer my question. Because I don't think you are. Okay, now you're here, and I just, I just reacted in time. Yeah, you're so creepy, Poe, and funny at the same time. Okay. There you are, Poe. I got you in time. Poe, you just saw me. Figure it out yourself. Wow, you're you're the dumbest in the game, Poe. I'm not gonna lie. Poe's actually the least intelligent in this game. I'm not gonna lie, because she can't see. Okay, I'm listening for Poe because I'm hearing her, and I'm gonna go check for Lala. All right, we have beaten night two. Sweet. <laughs> Six a.m. All right. Alright, we'll go back to the menu like it's asking me if I want to or not. Anyways, um, we will take on nights 3 and 4 in the next videos. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you've given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.